Step into the realm of Lumen Spiritus, the light of spirit, a channel dedicated to exploring spirituality and the esoteric. Join us on a journey of enlightenment and discovery as we delve into the mysteries of the unseen. In this video, explore the transformative realm of sound healing, unraveling the profound impact of music and sound on spiritual and healing practices. Uncover the therapeutic potential that resonates through melodies, unlocking the secrets to enhanced well-being. This video will be packed with interesting and mind-bending information. Kindly consider revisiting the content multiple times to reinforce the provided information. Also, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to Lumen Spiritus. They often say that music is the cure for the soul, but could it have a real potential to heal? The human experience is deeply intertwined with sound. Music, for instance, is a universal language that has the ability to stir emotions, evoke memories and even alter moods. Think about the last time your favorite song came on the radio. Didn't it make your heart race a little faster or perhaps brought a smile to your face? Now imagine nature's symphony, the rustling of leaves, the chirping of birds, the cascading of a waterfall. Isn't it soothing, calming even? This profound connection between us and sound is the foundation of sound healing, a practice rooted in ancient tradition. It operates on the belief that certain sound frequencies can facilitate healing, reduce stress, and promote well-being. From ancient civilizations to modern societies, sound has been a constant companion in our journey towards healing and wellness. Sound healing is not a new concept, but rather a practice deeply rooted in our past. Let's take a journey back in time, shall we? Picture the ancient civilizations of the world. In the snow-capped mountains of Tibet, the mesmerizing hum of singing bowls filled the air, their vibrations believed to promote healing and tranquility. Meanwhile, in the sun-baked landscapes of Australia, the Aboriginal people played the hauntingly beautiful didgeridoo. Its low-frequency sounds used to heal the body and soul. These ancient cultures understood something profound, the therapeutic power of sound. They knew that everything in the universe, including our bodies, is in a state of vibration, and that each vibration has a frequency. They harness these frequencies to promote healing and well-being. Fast forward to the 20th century, and this ancient wisdom was being explored and validated by scientists and researchers. One such individual was Dr. Royal Reif. In the early 1930s, Reif developed a machine that used electromagnetic frequencies to target and destroy harmful bacteria and viruses, a testament to the power of sound frequencies in promoting health. Then we have Jonathan Goldman, a pioneer in the field of sound healing. He authored numerous books on the subject, spreading awareness and deepening our understanding of how sound can be used for healing. Goldman's work is a beautiful blend of ancient wisdom and modern science, showing us that the practices of our ancestors still hold relevance today. So as we delve deeper into the world of sound healing, we begin to realize that this is not just a trend or a fad. It's not a new age gimmick. No, sound healing is a deeply ingrained practice, a testament to the wisdom of our ancestors and the power of the natural world. It's a practice that has endured, evolved, and continues to fascinate us with its potential. As we've seen, sound healing is not a new age fad, but a practice that has stood the test of time. But what does science have to say about sound healing? Let's delve into the research. Sound healing at its core is founded on the principle that everything in the universe, including our bodies, is in a constant state of vibration. The frequency at which we naturally vibrate is called our resonant frequency. When our natural resonance is disrupted by stress, illness or environmental factors, we can use sound frequencies to restore our balance and promote healing. One of the most intriguing examples of this is the Reif machine. Named after its inventor, Royal Raymond Reif, this device uses frequencies to target specific ailments. The theory is that every disease has a specific frequency, and by emitting the opposing frequency, the disease can be neutralized. While the Reif machine is not universally accepted in the medical community, it has nonetheless influenced the field of sound healing significantly. Now you might be wondering, is there any scientific evidence supporting the effectiveness of sound healing? The answer is yes, and it's growing. A study published in the Journal of Evidence-Based Complementary and Alternative Medicine found that sound therapy can significantly reduce stress and anxiety. Another study published in the American Journal of Health Promotion showed that a single session of drumming can boost the immune system. Moreover, research from the British National Institute of Health and Care Excellence 
has demonstrated that music therapy can improve quality of life for people with depression and may improve their ability to engage in social relationships. These studies, among others, show that sound healing can have a profound effect on our physical and mental well-being. However, it's important to note that the science of sound healing is still in its infancy. Many of the mechanisms through which sound affects our bodies are still unknown and are the subject of ongoing research. What's clear though is that sound, frequency and vibration have a significant impact on our bodies and our health. Science is still exploring the full potential of sound healing, but the findings so far are promising. In our modern world, how is sound healing being applied? This question brings us to the forefront of innovative wellness practices, where sound healing is making waves. One of the most popular applications today is through binaural beats. This technique involves playing two slightly different frequencies in each ear. The brain processes these frequencies and tunes into the difference, creating a third, binaural beat. This method is often used to encourage relaxation, creativity and focus, among other mental states. Then there are sound baths, immersive experiences where participants are bathed in sound waves produced by instruments like gongs, singing bowls and tuning forks. These sessions aim to induce deep relaxation and facilitate healing on both physical and emotional levels. Music therapy, another modern application, uses the therapeutic power of music to improve emotional health, motor skills, cognitive functioning, and quality of life. It's a versatile tool, aiding those with conditions ranging from autism to Alzheimer's. A key element across these modalities is the use of important healing frequencies, such as the solfeggio frequencies. These ancient scales are believed to impart spiritual blessings when sung in harmony. As for real-life examples, countless individuals report significant improvements in stress levels, emotional well-being, and physical health after engaging in sound healing practices. While results vary, these testimonials underscore the potential of sound as a healing tool. Sound healing continues to touch lives today, offering a unique path to wellness and balance. As we explore the world of sound, we find a symphony of possibilities for healing and harmony. The power of sound is truly fascinating, isn't it? It's incredible to realize how sound frequencies can potentially aid in our healing journey. From the historical uses, the scientific basis, to modern applications, we've explored the fascinating world of sound healing. But it's essential to remember, while sound frequencies might offer intriguing possibilities, they should not replace your regular therapy. Always consult your healthcare provider before making any changes to your treatment. Remember, the journey to wellness is personal and unique. Listen to your body and always seek professional advice when needed. The power of sound might just be another tool in your wellness toolkit. Drop us a comment below if you'd like to see more intriguing and thought-provoking videos like this one. Don't forget to like and subscribe to Lumen Spiritus for more captivating content. Your support is really important to our channel. Tell us which topic you'd like us to explore next.